Yes, my peoples, it's T. And today we are unboxing a big one. This is the LG Ultra Fine Display 27 inch for the Mac. Let's get it. So as you can see, obviously you can't see me right now because it's a very big box. Um, but we're gonna, we're gonna actually lay this down and unbox this beast of a display. So, um, annoyingly, I don't have any, any scissors here, but thankfully I have um, strong fingers. Oh, there we go. There we go, strong fingers have unlocked that. There, we're gonna open that there. It's all good, and then, there we go. Open that, okay, cool. So we're gonna lift this. This is probably one of the most awkward unboxings I've ever done in my life. Um, but yes, gonna put, it, put that away to the side. Put that away to the side. This accessory box, which you will get to shortly. And inside, we have the monitor. So let me get this box out of the way for you guys so you can actually see me. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> so that's unboxed. Still some more unboxing to go, but we'll get to that in a moment. So for now, what we'll do is open the accessory kit. So this is the LG, again, ultra fine display. Life's good. Um, so in the accessory box, you get a USB-C cable. We'll get more, more to that later on. Um, nice, nice length, which is Thunder, actually, it's actually a Thunderbolt 3 cable. So it can be used um, to transfer data as well as charge the, the, the MacBooks. But we'll get to that later. But the MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, MacBook Mini, Mac, iMac Pro, that's what it says on the packaging. So that's that. Inside we have the usual manuals and little quick start guides. Um, again, we don't need that. It's just, a, just, just a monitor. And inside, again, we have um, the, the guarantee and a larger um, extraction manual and regulatory, <laughs> regulatory information as well. Um, so again, we don't care about that. Here we have um, inside this box, we have a plate, which I believe this is probably something that we use to um, to wall mount potentially um, on this. Not quite sure, but we'll, we'll figure that out at some point. And the energy efficiency rating stickers. Um, some places you have to legally put that on, but we won't be using that. And power cable. Again, it's, it's a pretty decent length. Looks, looks like it's around one to two meters. So power cable there, as well as um, a never USB-C cable for the MacBook Pro one. Um, well, this is USB-C without the Thunderbolt, so slightly different there. So that's that. So put everything back here in this accessory box because these accessories are not going to be used yet. And of course we have the LG Ultra Fine Display in all its glory. So let's unbox that. Comes in this tin foil type of material. Um, looks like something that you put on after a marathon. Um, <laughs> but yes, that's that there. Um, and the base is also wrapped in the polystyrene type of material here. Just again to protect that in transit. Let's take that off, simply slide that off. And as you can see, very sturdy until we have this, this base has a lot of grip at the bottom, so I can't even move it at all. Um, so very sturdy, very good. And there you go. This is the LG Ultra Fine Display. Manscaped have partnered with Jampack and they have sent us the Performance Package 4.0, which is the latest and greatest. And I can confirm that it is a game changer. Oof, little Manscaped boxes here. We save balls. Um, Save my balls, that's for sure. You know, it gives you little handy little tips. You know, you can shave a, a crown into your into your crop. The lawnmower 4.0. This trimmer is the future of grooming. And dare I say, the greatest ball trimmer ever. Maybe, maybe. Crop preserver. 
Um, this is a bold deodorant. If I, if I give it a little smell, <laughs> delightful. <laughs> Absolutely delightful. Crop reviver. Um, so as the name says, this will revive your crop. And trust me guys, when I say your balls will thank you. So go over to manscaped.com. You get 20% off plus free shipping with the code jam pack. Head over there. Your balls will thank you later. Hit it. Now, my first impressions are obviously the bezels, the bezels very, very thick. I, I like my monitors that have really thin bezels, but of course um, that's fine. It has to be done. Um, the screen is very shiny and glossy. Again, some people prefer their screens to have a matte finish, but has a glossy finish here. Um, and yeah, so let's, let's, let's talk about this a little bit. So it comes with obviously the built-in um, selfie camera or say selfie camera, built-in web camera, which you can use, of course, meetings, Zoom calls, etc. cetera, um, as well as um, a 27 inch display, which is not 4K, but 5K, high quality. And you'll be seeing the imagery on this so clear, yeah, more, more clear than real life, essentially. Um, so this display, again, is 27 inches, as I mentioned before, as well as that, um, it has a 14 millisecond response time. So that's good. It also has, um, it's also 500 nits of brightness. So again, you'll be able to see um, everything very crystal clear on this. And of course it's been designed, especially for the Mac, see everything clear. It also has um, a built-in tilt function. So just to, just to compare it a little bit with, with the Mac, sorry, the Apple Studio display, um, which of course people would normally choose, choose between this or the official Apple display, which is just, um, that is actually 600 nits. Um, so slightly, slightly brighter. Um, and obviously it has the Apple design, um, but the Apple display as standard does not come with the tilt function. Um, you have to pay an extra 400 pound. Yes, you heard that right, an extra 400 pound just to tilt the monitor, which is insane. Um, so yes, the base model of the, of the, the Mac Studio display um, is actually also more expensive than this as well. Um, so again, um, this probably provides a better value for money in terms of, yes, it's not Mac, um, yes, it's not made by Apple. Of course, Apple products normally sync very well together, um, but this has all the key features you would kind of need for a display at a cheaper price, as well as a tilt function built in, still great quality um, and really good. So this LG um, ultra fine display also has built in speakers as well, as you would expect these days. And of course, yeah, some people obviously may not want to use it, but at the same time, there's a large audience that probably would want to use this built in speakers as most people would be coming from the, um, the old, you know, the previous um, IMAX um, and they will, they will, those came with speakers built in. Obviously Apple have discontinued, discontinued the 27 inch version of um, the iMac. And so they will be coming um, from that to this. And in terms of price, this, this, as I mentioned earlier, this is around the, the 1.2K mark, the 1,200, 1,100 mark, depending on where you, on where you go to purchase it, uh, which again is, is quite cheaper than the base model of the, 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 the you know, the Apple um, Mac display, which is, actually 1,500 um, starting price. Um, so yes, this is, this is actually um, a good kind of alternative version um, of the Mac Studio display. So I definitely would recommend if you wanna save some money but still get a feature jam-packed um, product, um, definitely go for the LG Ultrafine display. Um, so that's everything on this. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe and all that.